I'm Rabbi Ben Zeidman with Team Emmanuel at Temple Emmanuel, and we're running to get out in the morning, have some fun, and support an important organization. Hi, we're here today to honor the memory of Cheryl Diamond and honor all those people, women and men, who are fighting the fight today. My mother died of breast cancer, so it's a good opportunity for us to run, walk for a great cause. We only arrived in New York yesterday and we went into a runner's shop and saw a brochure and we thought this would be fabulous and what a great cause that the money is going towards. It seemed like a wonderful cause and wonderful event and beautiful day and we hopped on the subway and came down and it's been a lot of fun. Hi, I'm Naomi and these are my schleppers. We've been here for maybe three or four years already, schlepping. And I did this run uh, because my sister-in-law, Bila, she died a year ago from cancer. And during this race, I was like thinking of her and I devoted this race for her. Look at the definition of disease, it's evil. One of the definitions is evil. We've got to cure these diseases and we've got to fight evil. The only way we fight evil is with good deeds. This is a good deed doer. We wish all of you who are here with a story of your own, we are here to represent all that you do in terms of healing, recovery, and offering comfort to breast and ovarian cancer patients and survivors. Grace is 91 years old. Young, excuse me. Grace finished ahead of me again this year. And I just want to know that we came for a medal. And hopefully she'll be back for the next 120 years. What do you say about that, Grace? If Hershey's chocolate stays in business, she says we got a good deal. Hi, I'm Natalie Gerber. This is my daughter, Alice, my son, Lenny, my other guy, Charlie, and my wonderful husband, Johnny. Um, two years ago, my cousin and a bunch of my friends got together and ran this race. Well, I was just starting my chemo treatment and my little guy was six months old. This year, we decided this was our year to come do it ourselves. Uh, we now are a family of five. Thank God, doing well. It's my message to anyone who is in the midst of battle in this town. Um, you will get through it. There is always a light at the end of the tunnel. You need to focus on the beauty and the life and the joy that comes after all of this. We have now three amazing children, um, an amazing family. The support system has been with us from the start. Um, and, you know, these are tears of joy. These are, we have hard times, but we laugh through it all also. Um, and you just need to find those moments that get you through it. That there's hope that people can get better. And if we all fight together and pull together, you know, we will affect change. Change is already happening. I've seen so much change in the last 20 years. It's amazing. So there's no reason we can't beat this. I'm a 20 year survivor, so I know you can beat it. I am a 21 year survivor of breast cancer. And a couple of other people here are survivors as well. And our message is hang on, hang in, don't let go. There'll be hope somewhere at the end of that time. Just keep on fighting. There's a cure around the corner. Live every day as best as you can. Just love everyone because everybody loves you.